This is the story of how your life shapes your brain and how your brain shapes your life. In the six-part program, David Eagleman demonstrates how our brains create what we perceive as reality and how what we are is a construct within the brain circuitry that is never complete. We're not fixed. From cradle to grave, we are works in progress. I think what people will find here, I hope, if I've done my job right, is um, an inroad into understanding themselves a little bit better. In a presentation in Houston, Eagleman spoke of his fascination with the human brain's complexity. The brain contains a hundred billion neurons, uh, and every single neuron in your brain is about as complicated as the city of Houston. In sample clips from his series, Eagleman showed experiments he and other researchers have done to learn how the brain works. He shows how simple actions involve many coordinated brain patterns influenced by impulses that sometimes compete. You're made up of many different drives, all of whom are trying to be in control. He says the conscious reasoning part of the brain sometimes struggles with the basic impulses from the larger unconscious part of the brain. You know, when you're faced with some sort of temptation like warm chocolate chip cookies in front of you, part of your brain wants that. Part of your brain says, don't eat it, you're going to get fat, and you can argue with yourself. In the series, Eagleman also looks ahead to where brain research may lead in the future, and he says there's a lot more to learn. Why do brains sleep and dream? What is intelligence? How do you build consciousness out of physical pieces and parts? Those questions are still open territory. The PBS series, The Brain with David Eagleman, airs in the United States beginning Wednesday. Greg Flakus, VOA News, Houston. But actually what's going on in his brain isn't about the neurogenesis. It's about, as you pointed to at the end, it's about taking this network of connections and plugging and unplugging and...